plan to bring in shipping containers to Channel Side doesn't sound very appealing, but as Adam Weiner explains tonight, these containers will serve a whole new family friendly purpose. I used to work in the area in downtown and I used to get together with friends and, and come down to Channel Side, but we haven't done that in a long time. Karina Coriano and her family enjoying the cooler weather and their kids off for spring break, but she says their dining options at Channel Side Plaza not ideal. Yes, like all we have is the cooters and I thought there was a tapas bar here a few years ago, but yeah, there really isn't much for the kids. Lots of people apparently share this view, which is why changes are on the way. The ownership group looking to take advantage of the family friendly attractions along Channel Sign Drive, like the Florida Aquarium, the History Center and events at Amelie Arena. Part of the Channel Side Bay Plaza is in the process of being torn down. In its place is going to be a park right on the channel with a beer garden and some food options as well. You'll need to use your imagination here, but plans include using shipping containers as little pop up food stations, selling everything from burgers and sandwiches to oysters and acai bowls. The plaza is just one part of an even bigger development project called Water Street Tampa, which includes new apartments, hotels, shopping and a new USF School of Medicine. And it looks like, it's, you know, they're they're working on it. So I'm definitely, you know, looking forward to seeing what they're going to do. Coriano says those changes might bring her family down from Carrollwood here to Channelside more often. Uh, maybe do on a date night, my husband and myself, or do something, you know, or bring the kids to, then we will definitely, you know, be interested in it. The new plaza expected to open in late summer. In Tampa, Adam Weiner, ABC Action News.